Hi, I welcome in this new lesson in Bootstrap tutorial. In this lesson, I will explain a new classes, which is display, float, and position. So let me get started. But let me explain firstly the code here. I've created a division for a display a line, and then another division for display block to see the difference. And then another division to explain float and finally position. So let me start by display. So like we know uh, from CSS that display can be a line, a block, none, flex, and so other values. So here in Bootstrap we have a line to display the elements in the same line. We know that divisions display in separate lines. So we have here two divisions. But both of them has a class display a line. So both of them will be displayed in the same line. Let me try to remove here the class. Let me see. So the first division will display in a separate line. And vice versa in display block. So display block will display the spans uh, in different lines. Spanned by default display in the same line. So if we remove here and we have to remove it from here. So both of them will be displayed in the same line. But with display block, both of them will display in a separate line. We also have a display none to remove the element. So for example, here if we make display none. The span will be removed. We also have a trick here. What if I want to remove an element just for small screens? So display and make SM, which is short for small. We can make it large, LG, medium, MD, X large, XL. So the element will be exists. But if we resize the page and when the screen be started to be medium, the element will be disappeared. And we'll return back to a small screen, it will appear again. So this is everything about display. Let me now move to float. So float can be left or right and none. And this text none. So to make a float, you just type float and then left or right. We also can make it just floated when the screen is small or large. So here, for example, let me make it float LG. So it will be just floated in the right when the screen is large. Let me see. So because the screen now is small, so it will be by default to the left. But when we reset the page, so here is a medium screen. And let me make it large screen. The text will be floated to the right. And finally, position. Position can be static, relative, sticky, fixed, and absolute. Static is the default, but the important uh, positions is sticky and fixed. Why? You see here, just here, the fixed uh, division. Absolute displayed over the fixed division. So we can specify the fixed to be fixed top or fixed uh, bottom. So, for example, if we make it top, fixed top, so it will be fixed in the top of the page. And we can add margin to make a space in the top or in the right as we like, or we can make it fixed. Barum. So it will be fixed here in the power. And the same thing sticky. It can be sticky. Top. So here sticky. If we scroll down, it will be fixed in the top. And the same thing we can make it barum. But we can't see bottom now.
So the important here is fixed and sticky. And I think you know all of this from CSS. I just tell you how you can add the class in Bootstrap. So let me review it again. You can add display, just type D and then the value. And here for float, float and then the value. And finally position. The important in position is fixed. You can make it top or bottom. And sticky, you can make it top and bottom. So it's so simple. So that's everything in this lesson. And this is your turn now. You have to practice. So good luck and see you next time.